guys, it's Julie. Today I am here to do a breeches collection, but before I start off, I would like to give the biggest thank you of my life to all of you for over 200 subscribers, and I am just like, mind blown. Issa thanks you all too, but she's not here with me. It's just amazing, and I'm like, it's so happy, so thank you for that. I wanted to do a breeches collection since before we started a channel. I have quite a lot. For one, I find no matter what breeches I have, they always pill, so I like to have a wide variety so I can use them all longer. I do live in Michigan where I'm riding in 15 degree weather sometimes. Indoor is only insulated, it's not heated. It's very large, so it would be really expensive to heat. So I have winter breeches, I have show breeches, I have schooling breeches, I have a lot of different kinds for different reasons. First, let's start off with my all-time favorites, which are my show breeches, my tailored sportsmen. These are my first pair um, of tailoreds, they're my oldest. They are the Trophy Hunter side zip ones. I've had these for a long time, and the only complaint I have is that in the summer when I get sweaty and my legs get sweaty, they my um, boots bleed onto them, but that's not the breeches fault. They have held up so well. Keep in mind I don't ride in them like weekly, but I've had them for two and a half, maybe three years, and I cannot say one single complaint. They are the most comfortable, best things in the world. I love them to death. They have the Euro seat and then two front pockets. My second pair of tailors, which I got this summer at Glef, I hauled them. They're the Trophy Hunter front zips. Basically the same thing, just they zip up in the front. I wear these for showing and for clinics. And, and then we're gonna go to my second favorite. These are my favorites of schooling breeches. I ordered a pair of these at like the middle of winter because they were on sale and I really wanted a pair. Then I didn't get to wear them all winter because it was always too cold. When I was at Rolex, I got two more pairs. And Issa got some and we are obsessed. These are the yeah, Piper breeches by Smart Pack. They are awesome and amazing. These are the tan ones with teal piping. You just have like piping that is super fun. Oh, guys. Yeah. These ones I love. They go with anything. They have sock bottoms. They are just incredible and comfortable and super stretchy. But again, they have Euro seats. So they're super flattering. These are my favorite out of my pipers. They are the navy, I call them navy and lavender. They have a more like specific name. I love wearing these ones with a white polo. They don't look super over the top, so you can wear them to school at horse shows and stuff. And these are my second favorite ones. They're like the taupe with mint, I believe is what they're called. They might have a different name. They seem to hold up really great and I love them. And they come in a lot of fun colors, but they also have conservative ones. They have show ones that are side zips. They're really inexpensive for high quality breeches. Mother, I'm filming a video. Next for schooling breeches, I have the Equine Couture Stars and Stripes region. And they are just plain. They have really cool knee patches, which everyone, every time I wear them, always mentions them. They have sock bottoms, which make me look like I have cane goals. And then they just have stars right there, the American flag on the back, little equine couture symbol in red, white, and blue. But the only complaint I have is that they only have one button. The Pipers and Taylor Sportsman's all have two buttons. I don't know if it's because there's only one button or not, but the zipper always falls down. Super annoying and there's nothing I can really seem to do about it. Besides that, I love them. They've held up really well. They're super nice. They're patriotic. Who doesn't want to be patriotic? These are my oldest out of the group, except for my first pair of tailoreds. I loved these for a long time, but I have found ones I love more. Riding Sport Competitor Breeches or something. They're like Dover's version of Taylor Sportsman. They are pretty much the same style as tailored. They have the Velcro closure bottoms. They have two pockets on the front. I have nothing really bad to say about them. If you are gonna go spend $80, I'd spend it on Pipers over these. But I do love these and I do use them and I love using them if I want something nice and conservative but don't want to use my expensive ones. And last but not least are my winter breeches. The Debonair Power Stretch Fleece Breeches. All my winter breeches are black. I don't know why. 
if Piper comes out with winter breeches that are colorful, I will definitely get them and wear them. I love these. A lot of people at my barn love and use these. They do keep me warm. They do look super nice on, and they don't have pockets. But in the winter, I normally have like two coats on, so then I have like enough pockets that it doesn't matter if they're not in breeches. I have the Smart Pack winter, like their winter riding tights. They pretty much look the same, except for these ones have sock bottoms. But I can wear my normal belt with them, which I love. Um, it does have a pocket, which I love. Nothing really bad about them. Like, they're great winter breeches also. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you again so much for over 200 subscribers. We appreciate it so much. Like, comment, subscribe, share, comment video ideas because we love getting them and we are putting them on a list. Don't think we're just ignoring you. And we love replying to all your comments and it just makes us really happy and brightens our day. Have a great day, night, evening, whatever it is for you. And we'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. For your life